Well, we've got a little dusting of snow this morning. Hi guys, so it's Monday today, we've got auction viewing and uh, I'm going to go around the charity shops as well, that is in a little town called Nutsford. Um, so yeah, it's going to be good, I've got plenty of lot. oh that reminds me, I've not, I've not even got my little lot sheet with all my lots, uh, I usually put that in my pocket so I nearly forgot that and that would be a disaster. Um, but yeah, I need to go and grab that in a minute, go down there, spend a couple of hours down there, I always like to you know, really dig in the boxes and stuff. Sometimes if I can't be bothered by the end of the day, I might miss out a few lots in terms of like really digging in the boxes, but I do like to get on my hands and knees. Uh, and get you know get in the box and stuff see what's in there it's really exciting and uh, yeah I've got quite a lot of lots I think I've got close to 30 lots now normally I hover around the 20 to 25 lots I'm looking at and then normally I win about 10 to 13 something like that but um, yeah really excited about today so let's get into it My god it is so cold today, I can't believe it. Um, I'm just going to view in now, I don't think I'll be able to do any filming in there, I don't think they allow filming, I'm not sure, I'm sure I've seen like a little you know, thing on the wall saying not allowed to film in here or something or no filming or something, I don't know but um, I'm not going to film in there anyway but I will uh, catch up with you when I get around the charity shops. Right guys, I am done, I am out, I've wrote my list down, uh, I've scrubbed a few items off my list that I wasn't actually interested in upon viewing, um, but then there was other things I actually put on my list, there's some nice pool pottery and things like that, that I've actually put on my list and added to it, sorry if the lighting's not great, um, but yeah, I'm not going to walk up there, I'll just finish this segment before I walk up there, cause it's quite noisy up there. Um, so yeah, what was I going to say? Oh, you will have seen those board games and then books. Well, there's like six boxes of vintage annuals there. And there's like loads of board games. Now, the, the um, estimates are really low at like 20 or 30 quid. So I know the stuff in there isn't the best. But even if I get it for like 20 or 30 quid and cherry pick the best bits, it's still worth me doing. So I am going to have a bid on them. Um, but yeah, I've got quite a few lots I'm looking at. Quite a few like free boxes worth of miscellaneous stuff type lots. So yeah, hopefully get quite a lot of stuff and fill up that lock, lock up. So yeah, anyway, uh, if you want to follow on with the video, next I'm going to the charity shop. So you know, feel free to continue watching the video and join me around the charity shops.
Right then, so I'm back home now. Uh, just a couple of things from the charity shops today. I did miss out one or two charity shops uh, in Nutsford. Uh, just because of time, really. I wanted to get back and uh, do some packaging and stuff. Have some lunch and get, get going with the day. We are now 12 o'clock. Uh, pretty much bang on. Um, so yeah, I got this one for one ninety nine. It goes for 11 quid on FBA. Now, I am breaking my £15 rule just for the time being. Just to get some stuff up to FBA. Because as I said... I've not got much of an inventory up there, so I want to try and build a bit more of an inventory. So I'm going down for a ten to the, to a tenner for the time being. This one was three quid, and uh, it was going for um, nine pound merchant fulfilled. So probably like more like uh, twelve to fifteen FBA, probably about fifteen to be honest. So uh, yeah, quite good. That one's got a really good rank. I'm not too sure about that one. It had an okay rank, but I'd have to double check. Um, but that one had a really good rank, so I was happy with that one. And then finally, I got this uh, brass sort of book stand, I think it is. I'm not too sure, but I think it's a, a book stand. Um, and I paid three quid, so I was happy about that. I don't know what sort of money I'd be looking at on this. Maybe 15 to 20, something like that. I don't know, I'll have to have a look on sold. But it's quite a nice little thing. Nothing amazing, amazing. Nothing really spectacular or really, really ornate, but... It's, it's nice, you know, it's a nice thing. So, that's it for, t for today's video, guys. I've got the auction tomorrow. I am bidding online, um, and then I'm going to collect. I'm really, really excited. Hopefully, there'll be uh, a lot of stuff that I can get. I mean, I've got so many things wrote down, but it all depends on competitors, you know, and how much competition there is on the day. You know, sometimes I'll come out with only 20 or 30% of my lots, other days I might come out with 50% of my lots. So, you know, normally if I've got like 25 lots, I'm going to come out with minimum about 6 or 7. But sometimes I might even come out with 13, 14. So, you know, I've got about 25 to 30 lots this time. So it uh, should be pretty good. So anyway, I'll let you know how that goes. And I will see you in the next video, guys. And don't forget, give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. You going to say hi for the camera? Electra. Electra. I swear she still doesn't know her name.